Super Bowl less than two weeks away, Bay Area hotels are preparing for an influx of visitors. Eight on your side's Megan Gannon tells us what leaders in the hospitality industry are expecting now for this big weekend. Beach resorts and hotels here in Pinellas County are hoping that even with the Bucks playing at home and a limited number of fans at the Super Bowl, they will still feel an impact and see an uptick in business. While Raymond James Stadium is being prepped for Super Bowl 55, over at the beaches in Pinellas County, hotels and businesses hit hard by the COVID-19 pandemic are hoping to benefit from all the action. Especially the travel industry, because it's a chance, you know, it's a chance to have a shot in the arm um, in our recovery. Steve Hayes with Visit St. Pete Clearwater says even though this isn't how they expected the Super Bowl to take place during a pandemic and with limited fans, he thinks people will still come for the experience. I kind of equate it to when the Bolts won their championship. How many Bolts fans here rallied in different areas to cheer the team on, even though we couldn't physically watch them play? And so, you know, I, I think you'll see that. I, I think we have a chance to see that the, the, uh, the, the same thing. I also spoke with Todd Gerke from the Don Cesar. He tells me it's upsetting they won't get the business they originally expected. You know, for us, it is a little heartbreaking just to not have that demand that we were expecting a year ago for, for this big upcoming event, especially when your home team. In, in the event itself. But he is remaining hopeful for Super Bowl weekend, telling eight on your side in the last week things have started to pick up a little bit. Yeah, I mean, we're, we're estimating for good occupancy. We're, we're hoping to be filled for the weekend, um, certainly with some other ancillary special events and things taking place as well. The president and CEO of Visit St. Pete Clearwater is hoping that the visibility the Tampa Bay area receives during Super Bowl weekend will have a long term impact long after the last play on Super Bowl Sunday. Reporting in Pinellas County, Megan Gannon, 8 on your side.